Hi, welcome to my last two videos and tips for the 21 days on how to increase your energy vibration. I hope you've really, really enjoyed watching this um, and you've caught up on all the other previous tips and put them into practice. I've been practicing them for about 20 years. They work very effectively for me. Our home environment is all about a place of nurturing and support and love. It's a place where we can let down our barriers. We can have our thinking, our thoughts, our dreams, and it's a really, really special environment is to have a home. Not only that, it's linked to our base chakra, which is our root chakra as well, as well as our head chakra, our crown chakra and our root chakra are both supported by our home environment. So tip number 20 and 21, which I'm going to get to you shortly. If you're watching this, you're interested in visualizing the law of attraction, manifesting. You've been really bringing in a lot of good stuff for yourself in your life. My name is Sandra Nelson. I'm a life coach. I'm also a Reiki master. I'm an intuitive, psychic reader and healer. All my work's online and I work worldwide. I'm going to give you loads of really good content. This is the final two steps of 21 days. So tip number 20 is to meditate and visualize. So if you can, keep it simple. Get up in the morning after you've gone to the bathroom, whatever you've done, just sit up in bed, stretch your arms out, do a bit of a stretch. And if you are not getting out of bed, then sit up in bed and breathe. Do a breathing exercise and start to meditate. Even if you don't, even if you only meditate for five or 10 minutes, it's probably preferable if you can go out into nature and meditate. If you don't have access to that and you can't do that, and you can't go and sit in another room quietly and meditate, then meditate in the best place that you can. Practice discipline to meditate. The second part of that tip 21 is to also visualize. So meditation is where you are staying very awake and you're conscious of your thoughts. And visualization is where you will actually visualize what it is that you are going to create that day and what energy you are manifesting for yourself that day so create visualizations in your life and enhance that with meditation tip number 20. tip number 21 and again this is actually a twofold tip so tip number 21 at the very end of the series for the moment is to sit down with two pieces of paper and now that you've gone through all 21 days it's almost like you're back to the start Okay, you weren't expecting that, but it's almost like you're back to the start. And this is really important step because it's about not giving up, not giving up hope, not giving up trying, not giving up putting that energy and that effort in two pieces of paper, one piece, everything that you're going to release. Second piece of paper, everything that you're going to draw into your life. The first piece of paper, everything which you're letting go of, it could be weight, diet, health, uh, unhealthy relationships, unhealthy conversations, lack of boundaries, all sorts of things that you might be releasing. Okay. Write them down, fold up a piece of paper. If you can do it this way, make sure you do it in a safe way. I'm not at all advising people to set their house on fire. Okay. So if you can go outdoors away from anything, which is flammable, burn the piece of paper, release it. What I would do preferably is I would also honor the ashes and the ashes would be buried very in a very special place for me. Second thing is on the piece of paper that you have uh, started to write down what you're welcoming in. Please really focus on the joy that you have of welcoming these things into your life. OK, so focus on what is most joyful for you. Um, and what you would like to welcome into your life. And it could be that you'd like to welcome in the support of friendship, the support of really good listeners, of really good deep conversations, of deep thinking, that you'd like to learn how to support yourself more. You'd like to go on a course of education, whatever it is. I'm just throwing out ideas, but write down what you are welcoming into your life. Fold that up, put it in an envelope, and you can doodle on the envelope if you like. Sometimes I do that. I do little doodles and spirals. And place it on that special place, which we mentioned much earlier on, which was on a space, which is almost like an altar space. And that was tip number five. 
where you create a space for prayer for daily intention place the envelope in there and um, what I do is I place a crystal on top of it um, and sometimes I mostly forget what's actually written on the envelope but at some point in the future I'll kind of go I wonder I wonder what I wrote on that envelope and I'll go and I'll take it off I'm always amazed by how energy has just flowed into my life and it's helped me create those things so write it all down what you're releasing you're going to release that and what you're manifesting what you're welcoming in and you're going to get it namaste i hope you've really enjoyed following these 21 tips please let me know how you get on i'll be posting other videos on vision boards on manifesting on different aspects i really look forward to hearing your comments please subscribe hit the notifications i post my videos every tuesday on life coaching subjects on meditation on healing on intuitive development i'd really love to hear from you so please like share and um, I hope that you have enjoyed. Namaste.